Hey everybody, hope you guys are doing alright. So this is another revision to the idea that I shared a few days ago with the multi-purpose cleaning vehicle or security slash enforcement vehicle. Um, <clears throat> so it came to my mind like why not instead of having just completely sloped down, um, you could just add up uh, other angles because <clears throat> like the, the constantly sloping down actually starts to create a vertical fucking um, uh, point which would allow bullets to just hit and stay hit. So it's not as deflective as it could be. So by adding um, these curvatures here at uh, both the end and the front of the of the vehicle, <clears throat> you would allow you would have more deflection capability, thus allowing uh, less damage to be done to the vehicle. And then the design itself has just got a little bit more of a different aerodynamic uh, twist to it or uh, structure to it, I should say. But the essential design, as far as the trash, the recycling, the storage compartment, the crew quarters, the doors, the drivers. And all that and then also having the appendage here that's kind of like an anteater but it could be used to siphon up water um you could uh, put other things on there you could have like you know rams to help you know move or even like you could also perhaps even turn into like a type of a tractor you know make it very interdimensional or interchangeable <laughs> excuse me so um and this could be configured to you know we could mold <clears throat> the front end as needs to be to make it as conducive to interchangeable parts as possible so anyways but i just want to share with you guys the main change to this whole thing is kind of just the body the fuselage or whatever you want to call it and then also just here at the bottoms and in the ends at both ends front and the end <clears throat> um you would have uh just a, a this type of a sloping angle rather than just a continual downward slope because i think it'll be more uh, potential for deflection having it this way so and then you have the guard this one, this one goes a little too far these would need to guard the the tires from being shot out or you know something getting in the way of the of the tires so that the the tires are, are uh, protected because you don't want people to shoot up the tires because that would uh, take away your ability to be moved and i also and i have to give a shout out to matthew mcconaughey because i felt like it was him <clears throat> or his spirit or whatever that uh gave me the idea that to also make this this vehicle um be, being able to be stationary like a trailer like you could take the um you can make trailers you can you know stabilize them level them out on the ground and then you put stabilizers there to keep them stable and you could do the same thing with this type of vehicle and then by in doing so by turning this into a stationary vehicle you would then have a permanent or you know temporarily permanent um object there conducting surveillance and providing protection for people in that given area all the time Instead of just having it constantly traveling through, if you have a, just a, a spot that's designated to, to be there and it's not moving or anything, people are going to be less uh, motivated to do crime in, uh, in that area. <clears throat> and then as the crime dis dissipates in that area, you can then move to another area that has crime and do the same thing until that area is clean and just keep on doing that throughout the whole city until the whole city is eventually clean and then you move on to the next spot. So, all right. I love you guys. Hope you have a good day. Thanks. Bye.